All right, so we got some breaking news. Terrence Crawford versus Sean Porter is a done deal. Yep. I want to send a shout-out to my man Matthew Brown for Most Valid Opinion Podcast. Yeah, man. Sean Porter, Terrence Crawford, done deal in November. Oh, y'all excuse the rain. It's, it's pouring out here. But, yeah, man. Shouts out to Bob and Al for getting this done. Um, it, it seemed like... This was the path that it was on when both parties requested for an extension. And that's usually mean that a deal is you know, imminent, but they got it done. You know, no bullshit sides of the street. I'm told that it's not a joint pay-per-view. I don't know which side of the street that is going to be on, but it doesn't even matter. We're getting two of the best welterweights. Uh, Earl Spence is out with an injury. Jerron uh, Ennis has Thomas DeLorme. Keith Thurman still on hiatus, so Bud versus Porter is probably the best fight that can be made right now at 147 pounds. And I'm excited. Um, you let me know in the comments who do you think is going to win. Uh, I'm not sure. I'm not sure if Bud can stop Porter. I think Bud can outpoint him, but Sean Porter, it's a tough style for, for any fighter to get used to. Um, He's in your chest, and he bounces in and out a lot. And he's a very athletic fighter. Power leaves a lot to be desired. He kind of smothers. He kind of smothers a lot of his work, but he can just outwork you. And Terence Crawford has never been in there with a fighter. I'm going to say of this caliber that's still in or around his prime, and that fights this way. Um. So we're going to see if Bud can adjust. We're going to see if Bud is exactly who I think he is. If he can stop Sean Porter, that's that's a feat that's never been done. I mean, Earl Earl sat him down. Uh, Adrian Broner sat him down. But those are just more so flash knockdowns. Um, but nobody's ever, like, parked him, you know, <laughs> parked him for good. And we're we, we going to find out. We're going to find out. And... This should be Bud's last fight on top rank, if I'm not mistaken. Unless there's like a clause in the contract that states that the fight has to be on ESPN for it to be his last fight. But yeah, man, I'm definitely excited. Uh, I can't wait for this fight. Like I said in the comments, let me know who wins and who do you want to see the winner fight next. Don't forget to like, share, and subscribe. YSM Sports Media, we out.